we present a real-time approach for data-driven animation of hair. Our multilinear model utilizes a library of simulations created by an off-the-shelf hair simulation package and learns a compact, low-dimensional, reduced space model of hair. In this model, hair is represented as a function of a number of constituent factors, like length, softness, and dynamics. Our model has several properties that make it particularly appealing for interactive applications and games. It preserves the key dynamic properties of physical simulation at a fraction of the cost. It also gives continuous control over the groom and the dynamic properties. Our model deals efficiently with hair-body collisions in the reduced space and allows modeling and control of external phenomena, like the wind. We start by producing data sets of hair simulations driven by motion capture data, each with a different set of dynamic parameters or a groom. Our model works with hair guides and uses standard interpolation to produce the remaining hairs for rendering. Unlike prior models, however, we can deal with up to 4,000 hair guides in real time. We arrange the simulation data after post-processing into a data tensor and use n-mode SVD decomposition to decompose it into n-mode product of constituent factors, in this case corresponding to length and softness. Once the model is learned, we can synthesize new hair motions by specifying the factors and by conditioning the model on the current body pose and two previous hair configurations to model dynamics. Here we compare our results with standard hair simulation. Here you can see animations produced by varying the length factor. We are also able to extrapolate the length factor. Here are the animations produced by varying the softness factor. We can also produce more extreme hairstyle variations by segmenting hair into groups and altering lengths of hairs in each group. A key contribution of our model is collision detection which we formulate as a very efficient iterative least squares optimization over the hair coefficients in the reduced space. We now illustrate our results in more detail. One of the important parameters for collision detection is the subsampling rate. Notice that hair appearance in all the cases is visually identical despite the major speedup resulting from a larger subsampling factor. Our collision handling is not exclusive to hair. To illustrate this, we apply our technique to a sequence from Stable Spaces for Real-Time Clothing, published in SIGGRAPH 2010. Notice that original penetrations that required a custom renderer to resolve are handled well by our method. We compare the models produced with a different number of hair guides. Notice that the runtime of the three models is comparable, but the 4000 guide model on the right is better in modeling the appearance and dynamics. This is due to our model's ability to deal with a large number of guides, which in turn requires fewer interpolated hairs. In this example, we interactively change the constituent factors in our model. We also build another model that has wind direction and strength as constituent factors. As a result, we are able to interactively modulate these factors.